Stock politics now. Chairman of the Zenith Labour Party has called out the All Progressives Congress over the high cost of the party's nomination farms. The chairman believes this will discourage young people from vying for various positions since they would not be able to afford such fees imposed by the ruling party. Unlike what obtains in bigger political parties like the All Progressives Congress, the Zenith Labour Party says its nomination form from various positions are free to all. This is expected to give youths the opportunity to try out their hands in contesting for office while also championing the Not Too Young to Run Act. It falls short astronomical costs on nomination forms imposed by some political parties and urged President Muhammadu Buhari to intervene. Mr. President, you should not allow a hundred million naira as nomination fee for your party for president. When it was difficult for you to pay 10 million and people paid it for you, allow the young people give meaning. Mr. President, give meaning to the not too young to run bill, which you signed into an act by reducing it for young people to come and run. That's why here young people, we are not charging them anything. We are not charging women anything. Let them come from anywhere and come and run. And I'm sure if they are backed by young people and women, they'll be elected into the parliament. But not all people see things the way of the ZLP. There are those who believe that a presidential candidate who hopes to pull millions of votes in a general election should be able to buy a nomination form worth 100 million naira. They say the amount, which is equivalent to $175,000, is quite modest for a serious political party, especially when it's a ruling political party like the APC. The Electoral Act in Section 88 stipulates the maximum expenses for a candidate for any election as follows. Presidential candidate, 5 billion naira. Governorship candidate, 1 billion naira. Senatorial candidate, 100 million naira. House of Representative candidate, 70 million naira. State House of Assembly candidate, 30 million naira. Can it therefore be seen as reasonable if the political parties, particularly the APC, charge a minimum of 10% of the cap on election expenses as a non refundable fee for nomination forms to show seriousness of candidates? These questions continue to dominate discussions across platforms of communication.